took like a boy band. <laughs> <laughs> right, oh guys, welcome back to another trip episode. Thanks for joining us. We've got a special trip lined up this one. Boat camping. We're camping on a boat in the Abrolhos Islands, uh, just out of Port Gregory. Uh, so, Paul, this is Paul, he's the owner of the boat. You want to tell us a bit about the boat, bud? Mm. Um, seven and a half metre striper inboard. Oh, that's a big Volvo Penta. Yep. Hopefully, it should have the chooks to uh, easily punch us through there. Yep, hopefully we'll get there and back in yep. enough. Beautiful. So, 500 Beautiful. litres of fuel, yep. or 400 as we just found out. Yep. Beautiful. Uh, plenty of water, so we should be good to go. Get the ice maker ready to roll. Yep, plenty of rum. <laughs> so, so we've got Craig joining us and we've got Wayne joining us um, and also we're going to try something a bit different. We're just uh, scoping out the spot where we're going to actually launch the boat. It's a large boat. How big is it? Do you have any feet? Uh, it's 23 feet. 23 feet. It's a nice big heavy boat so we're actually going to try and launch it from the beach. We've got the 276 series here. going to see how they go pulling it out. I don't think we'll have a problem because it's nice and hard. So, But anyway, I reckon we go, go back to camp, get a see bit of sleep and... Get ready for an early day tomorrow, eh? What do you reckon, boys? Sounds good. Let's do it. Cheers, guys. Guys, we've had a nice sleep on the boat in the caravan park. It's the morning. It's it's bloody go time. Here we go. We just pulled the bit, nice big boat up. Milk pond out there. Luckily, it looks absolutely beautiful. How do you reckon we'll go, lads? I reckon we'll do pretty well. Eh? Yeah, yeah. Look, we've been blessed a little bit by the old weather gods there. Yeah, yeah. I think we're gonna nail this. Hopefully. Yep. Beautiful. What speed do you reckon we'll hit over there? And how long do you reckon it'll take? I reckon about an hour, hour and a half. Yeah, because we're sort of gonna head that way yeah. and then out the passage, we'll probably. I reckon it'll be a good. 25, 30 knots, which better comfortably sit on. Beautiful, beautiful. Well, anyway, we've been bloody blessed, as I said, so let's try and get this big thing in the water. Um, you don't really see these size boats getting launched down here that often, uh, but we got the 276s, which should suffice, I think. Okay. Uh, we'll get Craig on the drone, mate. How do you think you'll go there? Shall we go, mate? <laughs> should get a bit of footage, so. Won't Shall end we up go? in the drink. <laughs> <laughs> All right, right. Yeah. let's bloody get into let's it, it eh? Right. Cheers, guys. Couldn't get a bloody better morning. I'm so bloody amped for this, mate. Let's do it, eh? Nice big boat off the bloody Port Gregory Beach, eh? Hee-hee! <laughs> Alrighty. Coming back, are ya? Sweet. What do you mean to a bottle of cunt? Oh, good. Yep, yeah. Oh, it's quite easy. Let me know when this uh, wheel's up to the go, just pull it Yeah, no worries. Keep going, mate. Keep going. Keep going. You unhooked on the boat? Are you unhooked, Craig? Yeah. yeah. Keep going, mate. Nice and hard here, hopefully. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going, keep going. Yep, yep. Right, you unhooked, eh? Well done, lads. Well done. Got the old uh, necessities, mate. Yeah. Shit paper. <laughs> <laughs> what do 
What you reckon, boys? Excited? Stoked, mate. Let's do it, eh? BMR, this is Strike Road 3. Have you got a copy? Sat phone's ex the ice maker. One EPIRB there. Another EPIRB here. Can't get to that one. Don't give a f which one you set off, just set one off. <laughs> My extinguisher's here. One set of flares under the Craig's seat. There's one set of flares under this seat. There's a set of flares in that side compartment there. All your tag and fall in the water, but it should be pretty sweet. Let's do it, eh? Safe trip. Should be right. Can't go up to the Leander Passage and duck through there and hopefully head straight across. It looks, looks pretty smooth, so yeah. I'm hoping we should get a pretty good run. Let's see how we go, eh? It's on now. find a spot here. No dramas either way because we're sort of uh, protected by a bit of a, um, a bay so it should be nice to sleep in the boat overnight. We've got a mattress set up. I'll run you through all the um, all the sleeping arrangements later. It's nice and snug but I think it's nice eh? What do you reckon mate? I reckon. Yeah, yeah I'm a nice guy to cuddle up to aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> oh, enjoy guys. More, mate. There go, yeah. Tell you what, you can tick this bloody thing off the uh, bucket list. I'm about to set foot on bloody Abrolhos Island. Let's do it, baby. Yeah, it water's absolutely beautiful. Couldn't pick any better weather, eh, Paulie? Oh, Have not wrong. Look, How's it feel, mate? That's good. <laughs> Six months in the making. Yeah, exactly. See a uh, little tender that Paul got. Absolutely perfect for what we need it for.
Righto, we're here, loving it. I think it's time we're going to anchor the uh, anchor the tender up, and then we're off uh, to go for a bit of a dive. I think. See what's uh, under these waters. Let's do it. Woo! Day it is. Yeah. Cracking the first tinny, cooking a crayfish lunch, eh? Yeah. Cheers, lads. First yes. beer at a brolis. Yes. On your mate. Yes, mate. Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> what do you reckon, Petey? What's for lunch, bud? Sandwiches. Oh, again? <laughs> Just jump out and get some food, eh? Hey? You had chili swingers? Huh? You had chili? Yeah, not bad, too. Are you reckon, Craig? Not bad, eh? Lunchtime, beer and end. Still kicking there, that fresh. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. <laughs> Unreal. Sensational. Crazy thing, that was in the water half an hour ago, mate. Still kicking around. Bloody beautiful. On you, boys. Well done. Hard life. Good pressure. <laughs> Hell of an amount of pressure. What's in there, mate? Oh, it's just a little bit of spiced rum. Woo! Four litres of it. Righto, guys. Best time of the night, golden hour. Uh, us and the boys are just sitting back, having a couple of runs. Got old mate in the background over here. Thinks he might have a fish on. I think he's just dreaming anyway. One too many rums, I think. Um, absolute beautiful weather. We've had beautiful weather all day, so. Uh, I think it might be leftover roast, bit of fish for dinner, and maybe, uh, was it a cray? Was it yep, a crayfish? Yep, we have a nice big jumbo crayfish left, so it's time to get into the fishing tomorrow, but we'll see you. We'll get a bit of footage for the uh, cook up anyway, so what's he doing? I think, oh. <laughs> He's helped a bit of seaweed on there. He's trying, to, he's trying to show us some <laughs> footage of, of him catching on. something, but it's all bullshit. Don't believe a word that he says. <laughs> Cheers, guys.
know guys, it's dinner time. Paul, what are you cooking up, mate? You have a fried spud, beef from the fried spud, so slow cooker, a bit of blue bone fish is going on. Yeah, we caught a, caught a nice sized blue bone uh, today. We've got a couple of small fillets off of it. Um, gonna cook that, pick on that for a bit. Got the brisket from last night, bit of fried potato, and then back to seafood tomorrow, unfortunately, mate. And if we get a bit more I hungry, bloody hope so. <laughs> we'll have the jumbo crates sitting on ice. Oh, God. What are the bloody poor people doing tonight, champion? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's enjoy yeah. this, eh, lads? Have a great Cheers. bloody night. Cheers, mate. I wish that strap